Hello everyone, Pat Pat PR, the Patch and back with more Mass Effect. Last time we took down Saren's base, uh, and, uh, started to chase him across the galaxy. And this time I think we're gonna go find him and find him. the mission him update to the Citadel, Commander. Deeper. We got confirmation on those reinforcements. Ambassador Udino wants us to report back to the Citadel. The Council's massing a joint species fleet to deal with Saren and his Geth. Uh, about time. Took them long enough. Back to the Citadel, Joker. I want the Normandy at the head of that fleet. Yes, sir. Oh, okay. Well done. Good job, Shepard. Thanks to you, the Council's finally taking real action against Saren. The Ambassador is correct. If Saren is foolish enough to attack the Citadel, as you believe, we will be ready for him. Patrols are stationed at every mass relay linking Citadel space to the Terminus systems. How many ships are you sending to attack Ilos? Ilos is only accessible to the Mule Relay, deep inside the Terminus systems, Commander. If we send a fleet in there, the only possible outcome is full-scale war. Now is the time for discretion, Commander. Saren's greatest weapon was secrecy. Exposed, he is no longer a threat. This is over. One ship going into the Terminus systems won't start a war. I can be discreet. You detonated a nuclear device on Vermeer. I wouldn't call that discreet. Your style served you well in the Traverse, Commander. We recognize that. But Ilos requires a deft touch. We have the situation under control. Sovereign's the real threat. Saren's just a servant of the Reapers. Only you have seen the Reapers. And then only in visions. We won't invade the Terminus systems because of a dream. Secrecy isn't his greatest weapon. The Conduit is. Saren is a master manipulator. The Conduit is just a distraction from his real plan to attack the Citadel. One ship going into the Terminus systems won't start a war. Okay, how can I, I can be discreet. This? Shit. You detonated a nuclear device on Vermeer. I wouldn't call that discreet. Your style served you well in the Traverse, Commander. We recognize that. But Ilos requires a deft touch. We have the situation under control. If Saren finds the conduit, we're all screwed. We have to go to Ilos. Ambassador Udina, I get the sense Commander Shepard isn't willing to let this go. There are serious political implications here, Shepard. Humanity's made great gains thanks to you, but now you're becoming more trouble than you're worth. You bastard! You're selling us out! It's just politics, Commander. You've done your job, now let me do mine. We've locked out all the Normandy's primary systems until for the notice you're grounded. Are you insane? After everything I've done, you still don't believe me? I think it's time for you and your team to leave, Commander. This no longer concerns you. The Council can handle this, with my help, of course. Talking politics. Commander, Shepard, I cannot believe they did this to you. I am so sorry. It's not your fault. It's not right. You did everything they asked and more. Nobody else could have done what you did. The Council owes you everything, everything. Instead, they strip you of your command and ground the Normandy. Can't trust politicians. I Udina, the Council, they're all the same. Petty, blind, and stupid. Perhaps we could appeal, and get them to reverse their decision. I pushed them as hard as I could. They wouldn't budge. So you're going to walk away? You will just give up and doom the entire galaxy to extinction? 
I'll think of something. I just need some time. I believe in you, Shepard. I am with you every step of the way. Oh. Please, no. Please, God, no. Sorry oh. to interrupt, Commander. Got oh, a message thank from God, Captain Joker. Anderson. What did he want? Only said to meet him in that club in the wards. Flux. You should probably go meet with him. Alright. Bringing Garrison Tolly. Wait. That's right, we lost Ashley when we were attacking Saren's stronghold. Equalizing interior pressure with exterior atmosphere. Logged. The commanding officer Come is on. ashore. Exo Presley has the deck. Oh, uh, let's see. I haven't recorded in a long time, by the way. I'm not sure if I mentioned that at the start of this episode or what. Also, my window is open, so you may hear some birds. Well, not birds chirping because it's late summer. Uh, so you might hear crickets and maybe the wind and cars going by. But yeah, it's been a while since I. You seem I've... to be attracting unwanted attention, Tally. Several passerbys were staring at you. Many think less of Quarians for traveling in the flotilla and for creating the Geth. They see us as scavengers, little better than thieves. It is natural for people to dislike rootless wanderers. If Quarians would just settle another homeworld, you would not run into such concerns. Hmm. What was I saying before I was interrupted? We're almost halfway through this episode and we've gotten nothing done. Right, this is my first time recording this in probably over a month. And, uh, can we quick travel to Flux? Uh, I know it's in the wards. Yes. But yeah, so my controls. I, I don't remember any of the controls, really. I think Q is to... yep. Q is to go in and out of combat mode. Alright. Yep, just gotta head up the stairs. Really wish they had a mini-map. I think we already took care of Fist, so I don't know why they're. Out of my hands, Rita. I bring her back in a second, but she doesn't want to come. Low stakes quasar. Wait, what's this? Did I miss out on a mini game? Holy shit! All right, we've got to find Captain Anderson though. You know how stubborn your sister can be. The more you push and prod, the more she'll run away. That sounds like a side quest, but I'm not willing to. Do anything about it. Patron, Rita. There's Captain Anderson. I'm glad you came, Jimmy. I heard what happened. They pulled me off the mission. Just like when they forced you to give up the Normandy. I know, I'm sorry. I wanted to warn you, but there was no way to get a message to you before you docked. I know you're pissed off right now, but you can't give up. They all think this is over, but we both know it's not. You have to go to Islas. You have to stop Saren from using the conduit. There's only one ship that can get me into the Terminus systems undetected, and she's grounded. Citadel controls locked out all the Normandy systems, but if we override the Ambassador's orders, we can get them to bring the Normandy back online. You can be in the Terminus systems before anyone even knows you're gone. What's the plan? I can unlock the Normandy from one of the consoles in the Citadel Control Center. You'll have a few minutes before anyone realizes what happened. That's a restricted area patrolled by armed guards. How are you going to get in? Leave that to me. Just make sure you're in the Normandy when the systems come back online. There's got to be a better way. Ambassador Udina issued the lockdown order. If I can hack into the computer in his office, maybe I can override it. He won't just stand by while you use his computer. Hopefully he won't be there. If he is, I'll just have to think of something. The Ambassador won't forgive this, Captain. You'll be charged with treason, a capital offense. We don't have a lot of options. I break into the Ambassador's computer. 
or I take my chances with the patrols in Citadel Control. Hmm. Let's go with Citadel Control. If you're lucky, the patrols won't catch you. I'll be careful. You ready to get the hell off this station, Commander? Yeah, I'm ready. Let's do it. I'll I take care of the lockdown. You get down to the Normandy and tell Joker to stand by. All right, let's go ahead and head. You guys are blocking my way. Why? Let's head off to uh, back to the Normandy. Uh, pardon me, soldier. Could I take a moment of your time? Uh, no, I'm I'm done with side quests. I just want to get this game over with right now. Uh, Presidium. No. Wards. Uh, C sec. Yep, this is where I want to be. And we go up to the docking bay now. God, I feel like we've done nothing at all this episode. I'd love to see what the Normandy can do in a fight. How so? The Normandy is built for stealth, not combat. But the stealth drive adds a new tactical level to space combat as we know it. Surprise attacks, undetected flanking maneuvers. If it comes to a fight, I'd prefer a flotilla ship. It's easier to trust what you've worked on yourself. Well, yeah, we've only got less than a minute in the episode. Feels like we've done nothing. Uh, but yeah, next time we'll go ahead and take off in the Normandy to our final mission. I'll see you guys then.